Hi Tony, good morning. Morning, morning, morning. Can you tell me about your latest uh, venture or the project? Yes, uh, I was commissioned by the Central Cultural Fund of Sri Lanka to make a replica or a model of an ancient galleon that was sunk in Gaul Harbour. They want it in one tenth scale. It's quite a large model by any standards. Uh, it's made out of wood and it's made as it was in the old days. Uh, it was originally a sh British ship that was captured by the Dutch and then used between Batavia and Sri Lanka and it sank in the Gaul Harbour. We ha they have uh, excavated most of it during the, uh, the years 2002 and by 2004 they lost it again. Yes, what happened? Everything was catalogued and a book was made but we lost all for the tsunami in 2004. I was supposed to imagine and rebuild this within four months and without any details. Come on. And that's where he lives. A large garden. Oh, this is beautiful. Tony, are you going to set the sails? Put yes. it down? I'm unfurling the sails. Okay. Uh, they wanted me to have it furled so that it can show more details. Yeah. But I wanted to show a full set of sails so that it will look more comfortable to fill it. It's, it's a complete uh, co sail ship with all, all imaging sails. This is the main sail, which is a square wheel sail. This is According to the period 1659, everything was hand built, hand stitched. So, this type of sail was the standard sail at that time That's for, for this kind of ship? That's right. These are the reef points to so reduce size of the sail when you get a storm. What does it mean and what's the purpose of that? The sailors walked around here I see. to burn the sails up and the Flemish ports were one or more points of the sails. Do you mean they, they walk on this? They walk on this. Again, this they walked on that. Oh. These are the reef key points. Every detail, every knot has been done as per ancient shipbuilding. Yes. The main, the, the stage, the preventer stage, the four.
Holland. It's a, it's a skiffle emblem. I obtained it from one of the books I had, and I also engraved my name to keep it so that they know who built oh. it. And the rudder. Is there a wheel inside to turn this? No, we didn't have a wheel in this period. It was used, but with a, it was uh, a rudder and the tiller was used. Yeah. Can you show me where the tiller is? Is it there or? No, it's within the. Uh, inside. It is inside. The coxswain stayed on the after deck. You mean somewhere there? Further up, it was prior to the wheel before they started using the ship's wheel. Some objects like bottles jutting up, what are they? They are the cannons they use. Cannons, the cannons. Yes. They are 24 pounders. Yes. Fighting cannons. Yeah, 24 pounders. So all they were doing was war, no? Yeah. No, no, this was actually a merchantman. Merchant, but still but carrying? They carried guns. See. Actually, this was a British ship that was captured by the Dutch. How many cannons all together? They have 24 cannons. This is imagination, really. Yes. People have been excavating, they got only six. 